Dowling. Welcome to this quick fit workout. It is all about your arms. It's all about your core. It's all about some cardio. It's going to take about 15 minutes to give you this quick blast of energy. Work your body when you've only got that little snippet of time. For your practice today, you need a light set of weights. You need a heavy set of weights. And if you don't have either of those, grab some cans, whatever you got, or bring your thumb, your middle finger to touch. You're still going to get a great workout. There's always a way, everybody. So let's get started. So this is going to be interval training. So we're going to be 30 seconds on one exercise, 30 seconds on another. So for now, though, I want you to bring yourself into a tabletop. Walk your hands on your shoulders and just start to sway side to side with your hips, with your shoulders. It doesn't matter. I just want you to loosen up. Starting to bring some awareness into your body. Now pause, bring your hands on your shoulders. Anchor your shoulders down, give your tailbone a little tuck. Now, let the shoulder blades glide up to the sky, drop your chest down, hollow your belly. And then inhale, push, just like a little push up. Exhale, let your heart melt forward, shoulders to the sky, bear down, and inhale as you press. Exhale, bring it down. Inhale as you press. Again, take it down. Arms are strong and exhale as you press. Inhale, shoulders up, heart down and push it up. One more time, we take it down. Inhale, we push it up. Bring your thumbs, your index fingers to touch, slide them back so they're on your breastbone. Now shift your weight forward. We're just going to rock side to side once again. And I want you to keep your palms on the ground. Then start to circle it all the way around. Make those circles. We're just taking a minute or two at the beginning of this practice. Warm ourselves up. Make sure those arms are getting fired. Just circle around. It's going to be good, everybody. You can play your favorite playlist right about now. Crank it. Let that music motivate you. All right, we're going to pause. We're going to take it the other way. Circle around. Just circle around. A few more times right here, and then we're going to get going. We're going to go right into it. So get ready. Give yourself one big swirl. Ah. Open your hands up. Make your way into your high plank. Ah. Shoulders down, tailbone tucks. We're going to get started right on here. Tuck your tailbone. You can always drop to your knees. In fact, let's do a little bend and push. Bend and push. Bend, push. Bend, push. Keep it going. Bend, push. Bend, push. Now you can keep your knees on the mat. Bend and push. Just four. Three. Two. One. Pause. Tuck your tailbone under. Ah. It's only going to get harder from here. Pivot them over to the right, not to end up. Stag your feet, stack them. Shrug, shrug your shoulders together. Lift that hip to the sky. Just hold it here. You're just holding. Not a big deal. Feel that lift. So you're really working your arms, working your core. Ah. Now try to keep squeezing your shoulder blades down your back. Bring that hand all the way down to the ground, your back in that plank. Guess what? We're going to pivot it over to the other side. So you can stack your feet. You can stack. You can drop that bottom knee. We're going to squeeze the shoulders, bear down into that top part. Bottom arm, lift the hips, lift the ribs, gaze up. We're just holding. Woo -hoo, I just about lost my balance there. Squeeze and feel that lift. Feel that lift. Chin on your shoulder. Look all the way up past your hand. Keep pressing. Keep lifting. Feeling that reach. All right, find that plank pose once again. Tailbone tucks right here. Push up time, you know it. Down and up. Down and up. You can drop to your knees. Take it down and up. Give me one more. Press it back. Ah, come on up, everybody. Okay, feet open one. You're going to lunge over to the right, tap your elbow, and then come all the way up. So we're going to go tap and pull. Tap it down and up. Tap and pull. Take it down and up. That left leg never bends. We take it down and up. Down and up. Down and up. Give me one more. All right, bring it 
snap it down and up. Down and up. Now this time that right leg stays nice and straight. Heart rate should start to rise. Tap and pull. Tap and pull. Now, bringing me all the way in. I want you to come down to a tabletop. Find that plank pose once again. Good push ups. Down and up. Down and up. Down, up. Down and up. Push it back to a downward facing dog. Now, walk your feet up. Grab your heavier weights. Roll it open. Toes stretch straight ahead. Bend your knees. Also, get your chair. Elbows in and then push it up and press your weights. Pull it all the way in. Elbows touch. Reach it up and your weights a little tap. Pull it in. Your elbows touch. Reach it up and tap. Pull it in. Reach it up. Pull it in. Reach it up. And tap it in. One more time. Reach it up and then pull it in. And then lower it all the way down. Give it a bicep curl. Turn your palms down, you press. Give it a little bicep curl. Palms down, you push. We pull it up. Palms down, take it low. Elbows in, draw it up. And take it down. Pull it up. And take it down. Again, pull it up. Take it down. Pull it up. Push it down. Pull it up. And push it down, come all the way up. Release your weights. To the right, take it down, you tap. Take it down and up. Down, up, down, up, keep that smile. Take it down and up. Down, up, down, up, down and up. Keep it moving, down, up. Take it down and up. Fast or slow, doesn't matter. Keep it moving, down, and up, down, and up, we change the legs, down us up, left elbow down, we tap it up, down, and up, down, and up. That heart rate should start to rise, keep your right leg long. All right, shred it out. Find that tabletop. Find your tabletop. All right, grab a heavy weight. Put it in your right hand. Left leg back, curl your toes. Elbow up, kick it back. Bring it in and down. Pull it up, back, in and down. Pull it up, back, in, down. Take it up, back, in, bring it down. Take it up and hold. Just pull, squeeze, squeeze, four, three, two, one. Bring it down, change your hands. Right leg back, pull it up, kick back. Bring it in and down, bring it up. Back, in, down, take it up. Back, in, and down, take it up. Back, in, and down, take it up. Back, in, and down, bring it up and hold. You pulse, pulse, pulse. Five, four, three, two, one. You bring it all the way down. Ah, come on up, everybody. Shrug it out. Side taps. Take it down, left and right. Tap. 
reverse. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. We bring it in. Go. Ah. You're going to tap it to the right and left. Right and left. Right, left, right, and left. For four, three, two, one, twelve. Come pump it up. Up, up, and up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now tap it right, left, really lean, and lunge. Reach, tap, tap, tap. Four, three, two, one, pop.
Push your heels down and bring your chest to your thighs. And then bring your knees to the mat. Have a seat however you choose. Sweep your right arm around. Press your hand into your tricep. You kind of pull that arm across your chest. And just enjoy. So good, right? Ah. Now take that arm all the way to the sky. Bend the elbow. It's like you're patting your arm back here. Reach that left hand to your tricep again, not the shoulder, and kind of push it down and in. Ah. Relax your shoulders down. Take a nice deep breath. And then exhale, raise your arms, sweep it behind you, interlace your fingers. Just push. Roll the shoulders open, lift your forearms. Ah. Just feel that stretch across your chest. So good. If you're going to work that hard, you need to stretch it out. Shake your arms. Extend your right arm forward. Palm faces away. Now place your hand on your palm and kind of pull the palm back towards you so the fingertips face down and kind of lift your elbow to the sky so you can breathe into the forearm. Let that wrist unravel. Shake it out. Roll it open, and then sweep your left arm around. In fact, I want you to change the cross your legs too. So it doesn't matter which one you start up. Press your palm into that tricep and kind of pull the arm across your body so you can breathe into your upper back, especially behind that shoulder girl. Now the stretch we have at the end is great, but it's not nearly enough. So make sure you stretch out a little bit more. Now release and take that left arm all the way up. Bend the elbow. You've got to pat your arm back. Right hand up and grab onto that tricep and pull down and in. And just let yourself hang out here as you sit up nice and tall. Feel your heart rate come back down to normal. So the idea of adding that cardio in is get, getting your heart rate elevated. Doing those interval sets so your heart spikes up and drops down, spikes up and drops down. It helps you burn more calories. And then release your hands, sweep it around. Interlace your fingers, this time find a steeple grip and push. Shrug your shoulders open, lift the chest, lift the forearms. Feel that stretch all the way down from the chest, shoulders, biceps, triceps, into the forearms, into the wrists, and breathe it in. And then shake it out. Extend your left hand forward, palms face away, place your right hand on that palm, kind of pull it back, the so fingers towards you and down to the ground, lifting your elbow to the sky. Just stretch it out. Take one more deep breath. Exhale, release. Shake it out, everybody. You're going to have your arms all the way to the sky. Reach up. Exhale, bring your arms behind you. Ah, uh, shrug it open. Thanks for joining me on this quick little workout for cardio and arms. And also a little bit of core in there, too. Snuck it in there when you didn't even notice. My name is Debbie. I look forward to you joining me once again. Thanks so much. And if you haven't subscribed to this YouTube channel, please feel free. I'm going to be adding all kinds of good, lovely stuff.